Why, hello there. How are you? I'm Kenna. You just caught me in the middle of trying to figure out another puzzle. We're back with the eyes of Ara. I hope you all are doing well on this Tuesday. I'm wondering if maybe... Because you see how it's set up on the shield that the guy's holding? Maybe I'm supposed to do the mirror image of that with this one. Because you got the two Florida Lee. And the top left and bottom right hand corner. But it's... In this one, the moons are in the, like, they're opposites of each other. So I'm just wondering if maybe, and then put them in the opposite directions as well. So they, like I said, mirror each other. I'm, I'm just, uh, eh. No, okay. Unless this is just super specific about being lined up. Okay. Uh. I I don't I don't. It's, oh my god. Ooh, what's behind the wall? Oh, how pretty. Okay. Okay, I can't click on it. Maybe. Okay, we need one more. I'm wondering if that... <sighs> There's that thing in the tower that you can rotate the bays. There's a humming. And like a glow. I'm wondering if another orb is in there. But I don't know how. I don't know how you get it out. I mean, let's go look. I mean, let's let's look around. That brick kind of above me. Oh. We got all the pictures on this level. That's good. I have no idea. No, I thought maybe that was the gold light I was looking for. I don't know. I know we're going for the thing in the tower, but I get so easily distracted. No. I think I already tried that. I'm so unoriginal sometimes. <laughs> Is there anything in the book? I mean, it's, it's a... Yeah. Those look like squares and triangles. Okay. Is there... Okay, that's the knife. Pretty sure we're done with that. Yeah. Ugh. There. So triangle on top, square on bottom. Square pointing left. And then triangle pointing right. I just hit my microphone. Sorry. I I mean, maybe. That's... Okay. Come on. Okay, what's, what's this? What's the other one? And then we want... Okay. Wait. 
Oh, square on top. Squares are on the top. Triangles on the bottom. Okay, so these two. Ooh. Yay! What the hell are these? I know, okay, there's three of them, and I know there are like three slots. There's one at the bottom of the tower, one in the first room we enter in, and then one uh, in the room outside of the kitchen. But this. See? There's a humming. And there's... Let's see. Are you kidding me? I was turning it in the wrong direction like the complete fool I am. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah. Mm hmm. Okay, well, we've got the constellation puzzle set. But that. F oh! Maybe it doesn't. I thought they would go in there. Um. I thought for sure they would go in. Oh, uh, no! We've got to, we've got to, we've got to set the right picture on these things before they'll go in. Okay, so we got to find something that signifies. Was that was that a fish? I mean, we're by the sea. No, okay. That's missing a frame. Or if that's significant, that's in the frame. But I can't do anything with it. I can't even tell what it is. Okay. Sailboat? The puzzle does not want the sailboat. That's fine, I guess. Yeah, so we got one here. Oh, there's a fish. Maybe it's a fish in this one. I mean, that's a pretty brazen picture, right? And by brazen, I mean just very obvious. Maybe. No, it is not a fish. It is not a fish. Let's let's just go ahead and do this. Finish this one up. There you go. Oh, it's a collectible. All that trouble for a glowing blue orb that is basically a collectible, huh? Okay. And now I'm stuck with trying to figure out this nonsense. You, guy in the, the picture there, do you have any ideas? Let's go see. Do you want to fish? Oh, wasn't wasn't there like a guitar? Maybe that's it. The only reason I'm thinking it has something to do with the pictures around is because the 
the thing itself looks like a frame. Although maybe, maybe that's a, it's supposed to be a sword. I don't know. Is there only like, is there anything in here? Or is that a, when, is that a windmill? I think there actually was like, okay, I mean, Oh my god. That does... The frames do kind of look similar. Now that I'm looking at it. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything in here. As far as that puzzle is concerned. Okay. So... That doesn't really... No, it wasn't fish. Okay, you. What about you? Okay, what, what is significant? Not music. No, I don't see a weapon. Flag? I mean, he's holding one. It is. Okay. And then... This one, see, that doesn't have a frame or a, a picture in the frame. Okay. Maybe this guy? So, wh what are we thinking? I don't, sword, maybe? He's holding a sword and there's a sword thing picture. Let's give it a shot. Holy God. Okay, now where does this all lead? You see the wire here, okay. So I guess, don't they all kind of lead into the uh, the dining room? Yeah. Got those wires there, you see? Okay. Okay. Uh, they all converge to you. Hello. And these are going to go in these things. And we're going to slide them. Oh, oh. A picture within a picture. Picture suction. <laughs> Color wheel, I guess. I don't know. Okay. Nope. There we go. Okay, we're gonna have to line everything up because these turn, don't they? Yeah. Okay. It kind of looks like a chair. I don't know. And then wait no there oh the hell okay you can turn them don't know why you'd want to Huh. I am flummoxed. Ay, yay, yay.
Oh. Okay, that can turn. That, okay, small ones cannot turn. Um, maybe you're supposed to... Line that up? I don't know. Um, okay. Not that there had to have been another one. You're hiding here in the corner. Oh! What? Talking of pictureception. Wait a minute. Okay, this in the You see they've they've all got like the top one there, the small one's got three connectors. And then these two have two connectors. Are we supposed to Okay, like this has two connectors. And match them up. Late. Yeah. Okay. So that's going to be... And this one's, I think, it's got three, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we, we match it up with the, uh, the one that had three connectors. Which... Should be... That? Right? Red, yellow, blue. Okay, so now we only need to do... It's, it's, I'm one of those people like, I'm like, yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. And then I go back and I'm just like, I hit my microphone again. I start second guessing myself. I think maybe we wanted. Okay. Okay, I think you're okay. You're good. Because I think they're going to be like. I'm trying to think of the angle you're coming at this from. How you're supposed to be looking at this puzzle. Okay, let's do this one. I think this is going to be that. And then engage. Make it so. Now, what the hell? Maybe. I mean, you got the empty picture frame above the fireplace there. Maybe it goes there. Because you can come over here. And there's something below it that we can't get to. Maybe it unlocks it. Um... Okay. What have we come across? There's that door when we when we first come into this area. It's got kind of like a triangle like pattern. But does it fit in there? Is it gonna unlock the door? I guess we'll never know till we'll try. Till we try. I'm thinking these two guys say yes, that is what we do. So let's put you. Oh my god, we're a genius. We got an achievement. Oh, the radios. Let's just 
turn you off. Let's pixel hunt. Okay, you've got it open, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, God. March 12th, 1995. It has come as a surprise to me, but I'm not ashamed to admit it. I am enjoying having Astra and the children here. For years, the purchase of this castle has successfully ensured that I have been left well enough alone. A pleasant self-imposed social ostracism. I feel an unfamiliar fullness in my stomach, a warmth quite beyond the satisfaction of productive research. I think young Clementine has helped me realize that perhaps I've been lonely here. I like this girl and I don't like anyone. Uh, she enjoys the puzzles I build for her. Better yet, she can solve them. She's eager to learn about math and science and astronomy. Last night, I took her to the Western Terrace and showed her the stars. It was a clear night, and we could see Vega shining bright over the castle in the east. That might be important. While Mars shone a... Something red? I don't know. Dim red. Low in the western sky. That's important probably too. Clementine was visibly moved. I don't believe she has seen too many stars before uh, growing up amongst buildings and streetlights. Alexander, of course, spent the evening digging in the dirt and bringing his mother bugs and flowers. Perhaps the old caveat is true. We only need one true friend. That boy amuses me, though. I can see why Clementine finds him irritating. The two could hardly be more different. While she is purposeful and focused, he is whimsical and easily distracted. He loves to get into places he shouldn't and hide things that don't belong to him. I gave him some figurines to play with uh, last week. It took only a few days before they started disappearing and turning up in odd places. I had better secure my coin collection before they start disappearing, too. It has taken me years to locate... Contington's lost collection i don't need to have it scattered all over the castle again now that i'm so com close to comp completing the set okay so he's taking a liking to the girl because she's curious and intellectual uh boys a little more whimsical like a uh, mummy it seems We still have one face in that wall in the first part that we haven't been able to find. Oh, look. Coins. I wonder if we're supposed to... There we go. Okay. I think that's a sign for Gemini. Let's do it. The blue orbs say follow, and I do what I'm told. <laughs> no, I don't. Oh, another poster. 2392. Okay, that's gonna. I have a feeling we're gonna have a puzzle that um, we're gonna have to remember that 2932. A dagger scabbard hello I think that is the sign of Taurus and then we've got Aquarius there on the right okay so we're, we've got to find the puzzle for this I'm assuming this is this goes to a puzzle Perhaps this? Can we do anything with this? We can turn. Okay, so maybe Taurus. Like I said, I think that's Taurus. I keep saying Taurus or Taurus. I don't know if it matters. Who cares? Who cares? What's this?
Oh. Okay. Let's let's look down here real quick. The Gemini twins, Castro and Pollux. Okay. Edge of Infinity. The constellation Gemini. Gemini lies between the constellations of Taurus and Cancer and is one of the constellations of the Zodiac. The constellation contains 85 stars visible to the naked eye and is identifiable by its two brightest stars, Castor and Pollux, named for the heroes of Greek mythology, the Dioscuri. In Greek mythology, Gemini is associated with the twins, Castor and Pollux, two brothers together, known as the Dioscuri. They are commonly associated with horses and are often depicted in art and literature as helmeted horsemen armed with spears. Their mother was Leto, but while Castor was the mortal son of Tyndareus, the king of Sparta, Pollux was the son of Zeus. Mm, surprising. When Castor died, Pollux begged his father to grant Castor immortality, and thus the twins were united together in the heavens. The Geminids are one of the richest meteor showers of the year. They peak on December 13th and 14th. Hmm. Okay. You've seen two things that mention Castor and Pollux. I feel like that's going to be very important. Astrology is very key to this game. And what are you? Oh. Oh no, another. Oh. Another clock puzzle. Ugh. Gotta figure out a way to get. Um. That? And then you're gonna be the waves. I think that's. I think that's Aquarius. Wait. What was it? I think I think we're gonna. Nope. I need that twenty three ninety two. Huh? Okay. And now we need the Taurus again, right? Oh my God! Sometimes I amaze myself. Well, hello. Oh, now there's four of them. Weren't there like three? Ooh, I like that lamp. Or there's sconce, I, sh I should say. Okay, another one of those. So I think we're gonna have to find daggers, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. behind door number three a bathroom a puzzle in the bathroom okay Another one of those, okay. Ugh, somebody get some soft scrub in here. Oh. Another photo. So it seems we only have the puzzle under the... Well, we've got... There's that scabbard in the window, but... What about this door? Oh. Okay. I'm gonna write this down. Dun, 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 dun. I think that's gonna be important. Can't 
can't get in. Okay. Okay. And there's all those wires coming out from it. Everyone has seen the lights now. At first it was curious, but now Mum and Alex are getting nervous. Alex isn't exploring as much anymore. He's been having bad dreams, and when he's not running off and hiding, he spends all of his time drawing. Mum says the spirits are haunting us, that they don't want us here, and we should leave. She looks worried, and she's having trouble with her paintings. I've never seen her like this before. Uncle says he sh she shouldn't be so superstitious. He says the lights are just robots he built as part of war his... The work he's doing in the tower and that she shouldn't be afraid of a bunch of stupid toys i don't know what to believe i wish they would wouldn't fight like it i wish they wouldn't fight i like it here because i can read i am educated. and what are you well i'm in your box but Hmm. Oh. We're going to need a lover. That's what's going to open the box. Okay. Everybody keep your eye out for a lover. Oh, is this the kids' room? Pixel hunt. Oh. Oh boy. Um. The arrows are kind of lined up with the two chairs maybe maybe we need to turn them in the direct well, I mean once we find these particular maybe that's what we need to do is turn them in that direction hmm Oh, it's a little figurine. There's a little man in the floor. Oh dear. Needs a key. Oh, it's another one of these. Okay. Let's put you... Oh! Okay. I... Mm, I think I've... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Oh. 
Okay. Listen, if you need somebody to push buttons, I am your gal. Another collectible? Uh-oh. It's not fair. I don't want to leave just because mum is scared of some stupid lights. I want to stay here with uncle. I told her I'm not afraid of them, but she won't listen. I can't leave not now. I still haven't found my way to the tall tower. I need to get in. I need to know what's up there. But do you? I mean, do you really? Oh, hi. You want to help me out? No. You just, you want to lay down for a nap. That's typical. Oh. Oh. I think I've figured it out. If I'm understanding everything right, I have to set the middle brick in the third row into the correct position last of all. Then the door should open. It's time to see what secrets Crazy Catherine has been hiding. I'm going to try it tonight once everyone is in bed. Maybe I can find something in there to scare Alex. I told him if he keeps tearing pages out of my journal, her ghost would come and get him in the night. Maybe I can make good on that thread. <laughs> oh, older siblings. The middle brick in the third row. Into the correct position last of all. That's, that's going to be important. I have not come across any bricks, though. Hmm. You can spell Pollux. Wait, now you can spell Pollux. Is it O or U? I think it's Pollux. I don't know. But you can also spell Castor, right? Yeah. C A S T O R. Yeah. Okay, that's got to do with something. I don't I, I don't know what, but it's got to do with something. No way would they throw Pollux and, and Castor in her face the way they did. Okay, I'm pushing that. light in the box did something turn that light on okay we've got a couple more lights we need to find to be able to turn on what's in here oh. oh we found mom's room all the things oh well this is an easy one But that does not go in there. Listen, you don't know until you try. I, I... Oh! <laughs> that music reminds me so much of Harry Potter. Okay, so he was just hanging out in the cupboard, I guess. All right. And then, can we need to get? That's another one of the buttons. Mysteries of the Zodiac. Mother, can you please tell Alex to stop stealing my stuff? He pulled apart my music box again today. Uncle made that for me, and I don't want him to break it. I keep telling him they're not bath toys, but he won't listen to me. If he doesn't stop it, I'm going to start taking his things. See how he likes it. You tell him. Clementine? Is that the girl's name? They must they must have used Unity assets in this game because that Oh my god, no. But I recognize that lampshade from Death Bloom. Oh no. 
I I know when I'm beaten. I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm gonna leave that alone for now. Oh. Okay. Well, hey. Twinkle, twinkle. This goes with that puzzle in the kids' room. They're gonna spell out Pollux and Castor. It's just it, it's now dependent on which one goes with which. Okay, so that's the star one. Why? Why is this a thing? Ew. Oh. Cheat codes. <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay, let's write this down. Okay, so allegory of the arts was the one that we were just doing. So that's 1692. There are there are little things like a combination uh, input below the paintings, and then expulsion of the demons from Areza Arezzo. 1297. Death of Socrates. Okay. Oh yes, please. I I've only seen the two pictures though. Here, have that. Okay, let's let's two dots. Nothing. <clears throat> it's like reading Morse code. And that was the cross, okay. So you. You're gonna be the expulsion. Okay, it won't let me get any closer. Come on, don't be shy. Nothing in my inventory. Okay, you're going to be the allegory of whatever. Huh. You're just going to sit there, huh? Let me do all the work. Okay. okay this is going to be the star. Right? So the star is going to be... Caster. Okay. So you're the star. And that means the cross is going to be Pollux. I'm just going to check my work, make sure. I mean, I, there's no way it can't not be. Yeah. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. You, one of me. Could it be Pollux? And then you're going to be Caster. Sometimes the old noggin comes through, you know? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Oh, this shouldn't be too bad. Is it, we just got to line it up, right? That's what it looks like. Oh, can you imagine forces look like? Okay, so. Okay, there's two. Oh, they're really doubling down on the Gemini stuff, aren't they? Castor and Pollux. Pretty lined up, right? Maybe, yeah, there we go. Oh, no? Okay. We are. Mm. I thought we were rocking and rolling. What the hell do you go to? You look. Oh, I thought the candlestick. They're candlesticks. I thought that was something else. Oh boy, what does that go to? I don't know. Still can't get in there. No, I, I, I wanted to. Thank you. see oh money oh key oh that goes to the chest in the kids room I feel like that blue light's just sitting there judging me uh. oh boy okay rocket ship It's got that thing. Hmm. I wonder if it... Am I supposed to use that as the... This? Because it's got like a thing. No. Can we go in here? No, we cannot. Oh! Okay, that is the last place I would have thought that went. <laughs> okay. Uh, I I don't. Hmm. Oh. 
Floating lights, endless stars, and an inky blackness hiding demons. These images saturate my dreams, where at first I found inspiration, I now find only unease. I cannot sleep, I cannot focus, I cannot put brush to canvas without having the castle's blood shriek deep in my ears. The spirits of this place do not want wish to speak to me as I first thought. I awake afraid. We cannot remain here. Um, maybe you're a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Okay, well, I'm at a loss. Which should not be surprising. But we got to a new area. That's fun. I still want to find that last face. That's going to annoy me. But anyway, thank you all for joining me. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Leave a like, a dislike, subscribe, share the video. Uh, and that's what I have for you on this Tuesday. So I will see you all Thursday. You take care. And I'll see you then. Bye.